So my name is Dr. Regis Julia and I'm working at Imperial College. My uh, job role is a biomedical researcher in immunology. My current project is about asthma during childhood and teenage years, trying to understand better how young lungs respond to asthma. We think that white blood cells that keep us safe from infection can cause damage to blood vessels in the lungs, and this may contribute to heart disease when we are older. To do this, I use microscope to look on the minuscule scales how white blood cells work every day to protect us and but also understand why sometimes they got it wrong. We are currently wor working to discover new therapy to treat patients. A normal day in the lab does not really exist for me. Every day is very different and I'm doing always something different. I spend a lot of time on the microscope to take pictures and I also meet a lot of people working with me because no research can be done alone and we are always working as a team. And sometimes during most of the day at lunchtime we have some experts coming from overseas of, uh, or abroad, sometimes in the UK, and they come to explain their research and we are all trying to see how we can help each other to progress toward making better science. So the most unexpected and exciting things that are happening to my work, so it's difficult to say, so as I will say that the most exciting things that happen to me is going to conferences and scientific conferences all over the world. I went to multiple countries when I was doing my PhD and also doing my work. For example, this year I've been twice to the United States and next year I will go to Harvard also as well to visit the university. The experiments, as I said, are different every day and every day is different. So there is always an expecting things that's happening, but always different every day. So my career path into this role, uh, I did my university in Toulouse in the southwest of France and where I studied cellular biology and then I did a master in immunology and infectious disease. I then did a doctorate after my degrees, in, or it's a PhD, and then moved to London in 2017 at Primary University for what we called a postdoctoral researcher job, and I was then recruited at Imperial College at the National Heart and Lung Institute as a researcher in 2021. And if I could give advice to my old self, I would tell to always try new things and never be afraid to ask something. There are always a lot of people around and they are always willing to help and answer your question. Uh, I will always say that to be a good scientist, you have always to remain curious and it's a key to all good researchers.